everyone, welcome back to Toy Crush. Today, we're gonna be opening this big bag of toys as part of the $10 toy challenge. We were challenged by Two Epic Kids TV. And we're gonna open this bag full of toys today and see what we get. Let's go ahead and get started. Let's go ahead and start by opening the bag. And so we got a bag full of toys in here. And let's see what we get inside. So the first thing that I'm gonna pull out is Spider-Man. This is an ulti ultimate Spider-Man wall crawler. And so this ultimate Spider-Man wall crawler was $1.50 at Walmart. So just to see a close-up shot of the toy, this is Marvel's Ultimate Spider-Man wall crawler. And it says, throw them against the wall and watch them crawl. So we're going to go ahead and open this and check it out and see how it works. It's a little bit tough to get open, but I think I have an opening right here. So this Spider-Man wall crawler was $1.50. And this is what he looks like. His spider legs are very sticky. I don't know if you can see that. It's sticking to my fingers. And we're going to try to see how this works. So let's show this against the wall. And I'll just throw him there against the wall and we'll see how long he stays there and I'll video some some other toys from the bag. Let's go ahead and open and get our next toy out of the bag. So our next toy is a Doc McStuffin. So this is Stuffy and Rhonda and I got this toy for $2.50. Let's go ahead and open this and see what, what it comes with inside. So one of the things it comes with is Doc McStuffin's book, and it says Flat Tail Itis. Flat Tail Itis. It also includes two accessories up here that we'll get out in just a second. But let's go ahead and get out Stuffy, and Rhonda, and here's Rhonda, and then let's go ahead and get out the accessories as well. So the accessories came in a separate little plastic container and we'll get these out. So here are the extras. So we can put this on Rhonda if we need to. And we also have this piece right here and it looks like it'll fit on Stuffy's tail. Since his condition is known as flat tailitis, we can just put that right on Stuffy's tail. So this was a bargain, $2.50 for these nice Doc McStuffins toys. So here is Stuffy and Rhonda, and we'll set them back here. So the next item, let's go ahead and get it out from our bag. The next item in our bag is Finger tattoos. Let's go ahead and play with these finger tattoos. These finger tattoos include a different pirate set here. So we've got a pirate, we've got a shark, we've got a bird, and we've got a skull, and then a different pirate boy. And these pirate finger tattoos were $1. So we're gonna go ahead and open these and get them out and follow some instructions on putting the tattoos together. And it comes with lots of pages. I don't know if you can see this, but this set of tattoos comes with lots of different pages of tattoos. And here's some more with some different pirates on it. So these are really cute. Which one do you think I should put on my hand? On one of my fingers. Let's see. These are the two separate sheets. I think I'm going to go for maybe this pirate right here. I'm going to go ahead and put this one on. Since I'm going to use this one, I'm going to go ahead and cut him out of the package. So I'm going to cut him out of the package so that I can actually apply this to my finger. Once I've got it like this, then I'm going to go ahead and put this on my skin and I'm going to put him on right here on this finger. So there's a protective layer. I don't know that you guys can see that 
but I'm pulling that off and then I'm going to put this pirate right here on my skin and press down. Now that I have the pirate on my skin and I've pressed down, I'm going to use a damp cloth to put water onto the back of it and I'm going to hold it down for 30 seconds. Once I've held it down for 30 seconds, the tattoo should transfer to my finger. In 30 seconds, I just peel this off and peel my paper off and the tattoo should be on my finger. And there he is. So I can put these on all my fingers and do a little puppet show. I can say, arg, arg, ahoy mateys. These are fun little finger tattoos. The pirate tattoo come with two different sheets and there's three sheets of each one so you get six total sheets of pirate tattoos completely let's go ahead and open our next item out of the bag would you like to help us let's go ahead and see what we've got in here so our next item that we have is a hot wheels puzzle eraser this hot wheels puzzle eraser was a dollar 29 so let's go ahead and open it and put it together. So once you open the Hot Wheels puzzle eraser, you get all of these different pieces. And we're just going to take these pieces and try to put it together. It already comes kind of with the car already put together as an eraser, but we're going to add on and do our own. So this car already came put together and we can actually take it apart if we want to, but I'm going to go ahead and worry about the parts that aren't together so far. So we've got our base right here and I'm going to take the wheels and I'm going to put them in each of these open spots right here. And then the next part, I'm going to put in the interior of the car and it just goes right down over these two gray spots. And then I'm gonna put on the body of the car right here on top of that. So we put the body of the car on and there's our completed Hot Wheels puzzle eraser. So there's actually two of these in here and it was a really good deal. Do you guys wanna take a ride? I love these little pirate tattoos, they're fun. So let's go ahead and put those over here so that we can see all of the items that we have so far. Our bag of toys is getting smaller, so let's see what else we have inside. Our next item is a pencil stacker erasers, and these were 49 cents. These are just erasers that you add to your pencil, and we're going to go ahead and open them and put them on pencils to see how they work. So here's all the eraser pieces on that came in the package. And you can mix and match these however you want. If I want to put on my pencil this whole thing, I can, but I could also use a different nose if I wanted to, or I could use a different mouth. I could give her a beard if I wanted to. So let's go ahead and put these together. So the, I've got a pencil here, and what you're gonna wanna do when you do these is make sure that you put the bottom piece on first. So I'm going to do this guy, and I'll see if that'll stand up. I might have a little hard time. Okay, so I'm going to take my pencil, and I'm just going to slide it down over the pencil and put it on here. So here's the bow tie, and the next part I'm going to put on is I'm going to put on this mouthpiece with the beard. And then I'm going to grab the nose piece. And you just slide these down onto your eraser until you make your purse or onto your pencil until you make your person. So here we go. And we'll put these eyes on. And the eyes go on and they have a spot in the on the eyes where you can attach the glasses. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these glasses right in here. And then last but not least, we've got our hair to put on. And then the hat. So that's him done. Let's go ahead and work on her. So let's, I have a different pencil for her and I'm going to just put everything out of the package and put it on her. So let's first put on her lips. I'm gonna just slide it down. This pencil seems like it might be a little bit wider, but I can get it down there, hopefully. There we go. So we got her lips on and then we're gonna put her nose on. 
fan her eyeballs with her glasses on. And then her hair. And then we can slide everything up to where it needs to be for her. So these are great pencil erasers. Um, they, you can actually play with them as if they were puppets if you wanted to. You can just have them for going back to school, but they're a lot of fun. So hopefully if you see any of these out in your store, you'll go out and get them because they're fun. Ahoy, what could be left in this bag? Well, let's find out. So going into the bag, our next item is the Micro Blanks. These are by Rose Art and they're color blank micros. And it also includes a surprise glow in the dark figure. So it says the figures Parker, Trina, and Poe. And what you do is kind of like some of the other figures you have, you actually decide what you how you want to make these. So they've got eyes, they've got some paint in here, and let's go ahead and open these and see what we get. These were 69 cents. So this kit came with four different figures. This one in particular is a glow in the dark figure. But what you're supposed to do with these is paint them however you want to and then add any of these stickers on to make your own figure. And it does come with a little paint brush and we'll be using that. I'm just gonna do one of these today for this video, but I'm gonna go ahead and use this guy because I think he's kind of bright and you can see him very well. So let's go ahead and get started decorating. I'm gonna go ahead and use some white paint on my character. So I'm gonna open up the paint, it came with a paintbrush. So I'm just gonna dip it in there and I'm gonna actually use this white paint and paint right on the ears. So you can see this paint going on on the ears. And then I'm gonna add some more to this side as well. And I think using a thicker technique is even better than going lightly with this. If you use it thick, thick enough, you'll of course have to wait for it to dry, but it shows up a little bit better with that thick white paint. Now I'm going to go ahead and use a little bit of the black paint. So I'll snap that back together and then open up this black. Let me put him down. And use the black paint. And I'm just going to add a little bit of hair up on top. And you might be able to see this black paint a little bit better. So I'm just going to add some strokes for some hair. coming up through there. Once you've decided that you've used all the paint you need to, then it's time to decide on some stickers. So we're going to look at our sticker sheet and see what we want to add as far as his eyes go. So there's lots of different ones to choose from on our sticker sheet. I think I'm going to go with these eyes. So I'm going to try to peel these off and get an eye off of there and stick it on him. So let's go ahead and stick his eyeball right in here. So we've got that first eyeball done. My paint's still wet, so I'm trying to avoid hitting it too much, but if I do, it's okay. And then I'm gonna peel the next one off. So here's the other eyeball that I've chosen, and I'm gonna put these on. And then I think I'm gonna choose a little mouth. So on my sticker sheet, I'm going to look on here and choose a little mouth to go on. And maybe I'll choose to put, I'm kind of torn between this mouth and this mouth. I think I'll go with this mouth. So I'm going to go ahead and peel that off of there. If I can get it off. See if I can get that to come off. There we go. And I'm going to put that on as his mouth. So put it on right there. And I can peel it. If I do it quickly, I can peel it back off and then get it on there. So here's what my finished guy looks like. So he's so cute. This is great because you can make your own figures. It gave us four figures total, so it gave us other figures that we can actually do, including one special glow-in-the-dark figure. We got this toy for 69 cents. If you can find this toy, it is a huge, huge bargain. Let's get our next item out of our bag. So the next item that we have in here is a Hot Wheels mystery model. And these Hot Wheels mystery models were 97 cents. So let's go ahead and open this and see what we have in here. So it says that we got Drift King. So Drift King, you get a sticker with these and you get 
the actual vehicle. You get a sticker of the vehicle that you got. So we got Drift King, number eight, number eight on the sticker, number eight on the car. So very cool. So, so far we've gotten a lot with our under $10. So we're gonna go ahead and look. Look at Spider-Man back there, he's still hanging out there. We've got one item left in our bag. So let's go ahead and open this bag and see what that one item left in here is. And so our one item left, and now our bag's empty, completely empty. We got a Creo figure. This is a Creo City Bill Invasion figure, and it's a population two pack. So let's go ahead and see who's in here. I'm gonna use my scissors and cut it open. And it says you get two figures inside, so let's see who we have. The Population 2-pack. This I bought at Dollar Tree. It was $1. What a bargain. So we have all of our pieces in here. I'm going to pour them out, and then we'll go ahead and put this figure together. The package, it comes with this Creo Cityville Invasion sheet, and it tells you um, all the different characters that you could possibly get. By looking at the pieces that we have, I looked at this hat in particular, and it gave me the hint that we have Ranger Red and Lee Fang. So I'm going to go ahead and put Lee Fang and Ranger Red together. I'll start with Ranger Red. Ranger Red has these green pants and they attach into his chest plate right here. And then we can attach his head on. We just put the head right on top of there. And then we'll put that hat on that we had from earlier. He also has a fish that he carries in his hand. He's a ranger. So he's got this fish that he carries in his hand. And he also has this baton this baton that he carries. So now that we've put Ranger Red together, let's go ahead and put Lee Fang together. And when we put Lee Fang together, we've got his legs, put those into his chest plate, and then put his head on. And then we've got Lee Fang together, and all that we need to add are his claws. So we put one there. And we put the other one right here. So there you have it. We've got Ranger Red and Lee Fang. Both really great characters. So we've got both of them here. And these are all of our um, toys that we got for our $10 toy challenge. Our total amount that we spent on the $10 toy challenge was $9.00 and 44 cents. We were challenged by two Epic Kids TV, but we'd like to send out the challenge to some other YouTubers. We would like to challenge ACD Toy Collector, Spoji Moji, and Toy Kingdom. Get your $10 worth of toys and show everybody what you've got. And if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button and comment below what videos you'd like to see in the future. And don't forget to subscribe to Toy Crushed, where we do daily toy unboxing videos. Thanks for watching!